Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to Crystalline's Crystal Clear Visions, where I use my visions, tarot, oracle, music, movies, dreams, Reiki, whatever to help us get messages from the most high, from our angels, our ancestors, loved ones here and past over, okay? Thank you guys so much for all the love and support that you show me, uh, for liking the videos, subscribing to the channel, disliking the videos even helps me grow as well, okay? So thank you, I appreciate you all. Thank you to those who have also donated to the channel, to those who have booked readings with me, and those who have, um, visited my Shopify store okay so thank you guys again so much for all the support that you showed me okay um so we're gonna go ahead and get started oh wait I forgot y'all I'm sorry if you're new here <laughs> and you need to know how to get in touch with me check the description box it's gonna have all your links in order to get with me okay so let's see what message spirit has today remember you guys this tarot is general so um this is a general reading here for the collective take what resonates leave what doesn't i am not a doctor lawyer nurse or any of those types of things that require um licensing so please um Please use your discernment and check the people that you need to check for that situation, okay? Um, oh, yeah, y'all almost forgot. Y'all know I like to infuse my videos with a little bit of Reiki. Okay, Reiki is a traditional Japanese healing modality, okay? You don't have to do anything but be willing to accept the energy. It's going to come through my hands. I'm being used as a vessel. It's one of my gifts. I am a vessel to help send you healing energy, okay? Um, you may feel uh, tingly, you may not feel anything at all. Just take it out, it resonates if you accept that you will be getting some sort of healing and guess what, that is going to work for you, okay? So what I need you to do is take a deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. And in through the nose and out through the mouth and one more deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth all right so that energy will continue to transmit through you okay from me to you until i end this reading okay so let's go ahead and get started again take what resonates leave what doesn't this is a general read okay holy spirit what are you telling us about today what's going on so this is my law and order deck that i created um, with my guide um it has it's, i use it for puzzle pieces as far as in criminal cases i tend to pick up a lot more on those types of readings here okay so this may or may not resonate with you it may or may not even resonate with the reading usually it does though so let's see what's gonna go on spirit thank you so we have power here okay so someone could be struggling to get some sort of power somebody could be wanting some sort of power we also have malice here okay this malice with power here lets me know that someone is definitely wielding negative energy okay this is someone who is having a power struggle possibly within themselves someone struggling with the amount of power that they have or someone is struggling with the fact that they believe they're powerful yet they all possibly are not then we have living will and trust here okay so this could be concerning some sort of living will and trust here um with power i'm getting power of attorney so someone could be receiving some sort of legal document soon here um when it deals with money here um or someone could be having to make those type of executive family decisions soon okay um someone here had ill intent okay um <clears throat> that may be something that resonates here as well which could be what is behind this um this legal document that may be coming up for you in the future what else is going on 
anything else okay we got cover up here so someone may have tried to cover up some sort of legal documents here try to keep some sort of truth from coming out um about a legal situation here i'm getting um <clears throat> I'm getting strongly someone may have passed away here um, and some legal documents may have been forged possibly um, there was some ill intent here okay somebody tried to cover up this situation with these documents we have war here um, someone could have oh excuse me somebody could have um, declared war with someone here because of these um, documents here. These could be documents from someone going to a war, okay? So I'm getting like some information may be coming out about some falsified documents when it comes to some sort of war here. Someone could have passed away um, and they could have been, this person could have been in the military. Um, this person could have something something around this person being in the military being at war here this person could have passed away and again there was some sort of forgery um in the documentation here and then we have love spells okay so somebody may have possibly been doing love spells as well um yeah <laughs> This may have caused some sort of war here between the person that they were doing love spells with. Somebody may have gotten power hungry um, doing these love spells, trying to dominate someone. And I have child endangerment. That's too many to pop out, but I'm going to take that one off the top. So someone definitely could be dealing with some sort of child endangerment here. Someone may not be um, taking care of that, their child properly here um, because this person is participating in love spells, trying to change someone's um, future here, trying to cover up that they are trying to have power over someone here. We also have leg here, so that could be important to someone. Um, but let's see what is going on with the kippers. Already, y'all got a lot of stuff going on. It's all good. Makes for a fun reading. <laughs> what's going on here, Spirit? What is this? What's going on? What's the story here? What do we need to know? We got power, malice, living, willing, trust, cover up, war, love spells. Somebody could have been doing love spells and now they're having to go to war. So we have the main person here. So this is a feminine energy here. Um, collected. This could be you or this could be someone around you here. This is the main character of the story here. So that is what this story is about. So this is a feminine energy that's been passing, passing love spells here. Um, this person may have gotten um started to be malicious here with these love spells here this person may have declared some sort of war here and is trying to keep something um covered up with this living will and trust here we have rich girl so that lets me know that this person was someone who um cared about their status here this is someone who um, wanted to live this rich girl lifestyle to someone who possibly um, did not have a job. This is someone who possibly could have came up off of a living will and trust here, or someone could be owed a living will and trust here, and it's going to make this person um, rich here. Um, but take it how it resonates. Card number 12 is the hangman. So this could be someone that is getting some sort of enlightenment on um, possibly a living will and trust here. This is also someone that is getting some enlightenment on um, <clears throat> some sort of power struggle that they had here. Now there's also two feminines here and I also have a masculine energy here with this main person. Now this is the counterpart here to this main feminine energy here. So this could be a couple here that could be working against a rich girl here. Um, um, creating war here 
having malice against this rich girl here. These are people who are trying to obtain power over this rich girl, this couple here, okay? Um, they could be doing love spells as well, or one person could be doing love spells over the other person here. Um, I feel as though, yeah, because they're at war. I feel as though these two people are having war within their relationship, and they're both trying to maintain power here okay they could be trying to maintain power over a rich girl here which is causing them to work against each other um but again take it how it resonates here we have meetings here and we also have um the military man here so i did say someone could have passed away in war and had some sight so hold on y'all Somebody could have definitely been involved in a war here. This person could have passed away and could have left some sort of living will and trust to someone. Um, and someone possibly tried to cover that up. But we also have the story where there is a couple here that could be doing love spells against each other. Um, they and tried to do love spells upon someone else. These people tended to get too power hungry and now they are, with this military person being looked at possibly by the police, someone who wears uniforms. This could be someone who is being investigated by an investigator here. Um, this is someone who is setting out on the adventure, on a journey. So this person is gathering information here. Um, then we have yeah, meetings here. So there could be someone that is meeting up with um, a police officer and possibly um, giving some sort of information on the other person here um, when it comes to this war here. Um, so it could be two people buddying up together, trying to figure out how to cast or how to... Um, carry out this war here but again someone here has ill intentions with this malice here so this could be people backing out of things that they say when it comes to um the type of help that they would give when it comes to some sort of war that is going on here as well as the power with power here someone is, is trying to someone is having like a power struggle here Okay, so there could be a power struggle within a relationship where there's a masculine and a feminine that could be going at war against each other. There could be a masculine and feminine that are teaming up to go to war against a rich person, a rich girl, or someone that is in high status here. Um, there's a lot of different scenarios here, you guys. So um, We do have bad news here at the bottom of the deck, so someone could be receiving some bad news soon. Um, <clears throat> But I do have, like I said, someone is being investigated as well. Um, someone could be having some sort of talk with the police as well. I see that here. And we have expectations. So someone could is waiting for something to change, okay? So these two people um, that teamed up together or these people, it's like they're all, everybody, okay, it's the couple. It's Because it's so many of y'all and there's so many downloads I'm getting. So there's a couple here and this couple that is having, um, that are teaming up together. These would be the ones that are working together. Yeah, they, they are working. I don't feel as though they have any issues within their relationship at this moment. But these two people that are working together, they are working against this rich girl here, okay? This person who has um, some sort of status here, some sort of money here. And they are trying to, you know, they're, trying to make sure that their workings are working so these people are watching and waiting on um, things to change there's also an investigator who's watching and waiting for um, some sort of information to come out here um, we also have the main person the couple that are fighting each other they're watching and waiting to make sure that the spells that they're casting against each other are working here so there's a lot of people that are doing like doing work you know, sending negative energy, having negative vibes. Um, there are a number of people here that are watching and waiting to see what is going to happen next year. These people have been working extremely hard to make sure that 
um, their plans that they are trying to have are carried out. But I feel as though um, these things may not be working as they're hoping here, which is why they're constantly watching and waiting. Yes, we have a good gentleman that has entered the chat. So this could be a father figure here. This could be someone who, um, for me, this could be someone who comes off as a good gentleman. This is someone who is upstanding, someone you would get good advice from, okay? So someone could be trying to get advice at, at this time on what it is that they should be doing, or you may be needing to seek out someone that you can get good advice from. This reminds me of possibly an attorney, so someone could be needing to seek out an attorney here. Um, we also have this being the strength here. He's looking like he's taming the lion. So this is someone that would um, fight for you so this could be someone in the a fatherly figure that could be fighting um, to help this this rich girl and also um, this main male here as well um, and that's if this is the couple that are at odds with each other or if this is a single masculine, he could be getting help from a father figure on what to do about a feminine energy that he is possibly interested in. I am seeing that here. We do have love spells. This person may think that this feminine energy has a love spell on them. Um, There could be someone trying to come in between a couple coming together as well using love spells. And there's a masculine energy here that could be passed over that is helping. Um, or this person doesn't have to be passed over, but just some sort of masculine energy that is trying to influence um, a positive change here, okay? This also could be someone um, that is trying to if there is something with this war here, this is the person that is trying to give level-headed advice here um, to help. This is someone, so someone could be like seeking higher power, okay? Someone that has a little bit more knowledge on a subject. So like if I'm getting, if someone is doing um, negative spell work, malicious spell work, and they're sending it at someone and it's not working. This is someone that is getting ready to seek higher power, higher authority here. And we only at 17, 17 on the clock. It seems like I've been reading a long time. I hope y'all getting something out of this. We have hope in big water here. So this speaks about um, there's going to be a change, okay, an inevitable change, be it a positive or negative change. To me, this is like the Wheel of Fortune in the deck, but let me pull out the book to make sure. Um, it's card number 36, which breaks down to nine, and nine is the number of completion. It's also the last the last card in the deck, so that's letting me know that um, this is where the reading is going to end as well, but it says... Um, the general statement of this card is positive. It shows an improving situation, okay? Um, so if you are someone who has someone going to war against you, don't worry about that. Um, if someone passes away, my condolences, but they are leaving you a living will and trust here. Um, also, you could be meeting someone um, important here. Um, and again, there could be something dealing with the cover-up that may be coming to light, okay? So positive things are happening, okay? Um, those are the wishes. This card represents big dreams and hopes, so whatever you're dreaming of, dream big. Um, those are the wishes and dreams that are firmly established in our soul, which is also represented by this card. However, it also shows another aspect of idle pipe dreams, illusions. So, um, yeah, we said, I said cover up here. So something is definitely about to be uncovered here. Um, somebody's about to, if there's a police officer here, I feel as though this person's about to get a big lead on a case here to be able to close some sort of case out. Okay. Um, and the card becomes a warning card, perhaps even a warning against drugs and alcohol. Since they are also a kind of illusion. 
Um, this can also stand for deceptions and excessive expectations, okay? And it is kind of close to expectations here. So there could be an older masculine energy here that is obsessing over a situation as well. They could be obsess yeah, obsessing over power here. This is someone who wants to come off as being very... Um, um loving on the outside but this is someone who would break down to any type of tactic okay to take over a situation to make a situation go in their way so this is definitely someone that could be a little bit power hungry so beware of that type of person as well make sure you're knowing who you're gathering information from okay make sure that you are not falling for illusions okay falling for what people are showing you on the outside so i'm getting this this feeling of um you should start looking deeper for for more answers here when it comes to um, your beliefs, okay? What it is that you believe in. And because I heard that go deeper, I'm gonna go just a little bit deeper with these cards, okay? So I thought I was about to leave out. <laughs> I guess they were saying end out that deck, okay? So we're gonna go a little bit deeper. We're gonna see what has been covered up here. Let's see what's being covered up here. What is being uncovered? What are the illusions in this situation? So we have the five of wands here. The five of wands talks about competition. So there are a lot of people that are competing. It's a lot of people that are in this get in this situation here, okay? So it's not just one person um, competing, having war here. It's a lot of people grouping up together to make some sort of outcome come out their way here. Um, this is also challenges, things changing, things moving rapidly as well. So someone could be covering up that they're trying to move here. Someone could be covering up that someone is attacking them or that they are trying to attack someone here. We have the Eight of Cups here. So someone could be covering up the fact that they're trying to keep someone from walking away. We do have love spells here. Um, so someone's definitely trying to keep somebody from walking away, trying to keep somebody from speaking some sort of truth, trying to keep someone from healing with this blue lace agate here. Um, this is someone who possibly, there's someone here that is also seeking forgiveness with this road night. Um, this person wants love and emotion no healing okay so with this eight of cups this is somebody wanting to walk towards um a situation that they want to be in someone that they want to be with or something that they want to do just someone following their heart um so this could be someone that is battling within themselves about following their heart here um also this again is someone who is battling having a power struggle with someone else here this is groups of people fighting okay just fighting about things that they're very passionate about okay What else is going on? What's being covered up? What's coming to light spirit? All right, we have the Queen of Wands here. Um, this is someone who can be seen as very attractive, very loving here. This is someone who um, people, this is a, a leader here, someone who people follow, someone who people want to um, get to know here. And then on her, in her negative, yeah, this is someone who is, has energy, power, passion here. In her negative aspects, though, it is someone who could possibly sleep around here, someone who has a lot of different, um, a lot of different partners um someone who again can be very malicious here so this could be someone who would dibble in doing magic against other people as well so this could be someone a feminine energy here at aries Pi i'm sorry aries sagittarius or leo but it doesn't have to be this is, can just be someone who um is very emotion driven here this is someone who makes plans and, and makes sure that they're executed here this is someone who can become very power hungry okay this is someone who would go through great lens right this could be um <clears throat> this could be someone like i said this is someone that could do a lot of partying um this is the life of the party the queen of wands here this could be someone who is not wanting to be committed as well um this person could be hiding that they are sending multiple attacks here with this nine of wands here again it's a group of people that are sending multiple attacks these people are working out of their passion out of their lowest selves um again trying to keep someone from being grounded here um 
<clears throat> but with this labradorite, we have limited potential and sleeping soundly here. So this person may be trying to keep someone sleeping soundly. If you catch what I'm throwing down here, um, and they've been doing this over and over again, okay? They feel like they can do this forever, right? Yeah, they want someone to miss out on some sort of opportunity here with this Four of Cups here. They want someone to remain um, very quiet here. They don't want this person to speak truth. They don't want any healing to come about a situation here. So, again, there's definitely someone doing love spells. We're definitely getting this feminine energy real heavy here. Um... <clears throat> This could be someone that's very emotional as well, okay? Or they could have like an emotional, like a, a water sign moon because I'm seeing like a lot of water and a lot of blue. And that talks about healing here. Okay, we got the avatarine. So this is someone trying to block someone from moving forward here. This is someone who's, who's trying to defend themselves um from other people here it says aventurine which talks about good luck good luck manifestation so there's someone here um this could be this rich girl energy or this main feminine energy here um but there's someone here who is um defending themselves very well this is someone who's very skilled in battle this is someone who has a lot of ancestors um a spiritual team around them that's helping them to fight off blockages that are being sent their way um and then there's also someone here that is sending blockages someone's way okay this is someone who is um could be rallying up people to bully against one person here we have the nine of swords so someone doesn't want anyone to know that they are in distress here that they are having a hard time sleeping here it says antigorite flow intuition so someone is not connected to their intuition here this is someone who wasn't listening to their intuition which is why they're having this power struggle here we have the ten of cups here so this is talking about happiness so someone definitely is not happy um someone here is is very happy or is going to be very happy here as well it just depends on what end of the spectrum you're on and it says snowflake obsidian is this stone so that may be something you may want to connect with um self-reflection protection growth here so someone is definitely growing while someone has was not protecting themselves and they are actually losing in a situation here we do have the ace of cups at the bottom of the deck to end it off so someone is definitely pop, um, getting some new love here we have a diamond here so someone could be getting um offered some sort of marriage proposal here um it says purity truth and perfection so someone could be definitely getting some um true pure understanding on a situation possibly involving love or something that they are wanting to go towards i do have the eight of wands underneath here so someone definitely could be getting some sort of communication um possibly a heartfelt message from someone so I'm going to leave it there, you guys. We are at 27:21 as I check the clock, okay? So that number may be important to somebody out there. I hope that you guys got all the messages that you may have needed out of this situation. Um, let me know by sending me an email. Don't forget to hit that like button. Um, dislike if you didn't resonate with it. Share the video. Um, subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so that you see when I upload videos. And until the next video, I love you guys so much. Bye.